Hey Swarmers! Welcome back to The Hive. As our world seems to become more and more divided, it has become clearer to us at The Hive that the only way forward is together. So we're bringing it back to the sustainable development goals this week. To recap, in 2015, world leaders agreed to 17 global goals, officially known as the Sustainable Development Goals, or SDGs. These goals aim to create a better world by 2030, by ending poverty, fighting inequality, and addressing the urgency of climate change together. Let's talk about life, or more specifically, biomass, the total mass of organisms in a given area or volume. Measured in terms of carbon content to factor out variable components like water, all life on Earth weighs about 550 gigatons, and the vast, vast majority of that is comprised of life on land. Everything from bacteria, to fungus, to insects, to plants, to trees, to animals, to humans, though we make up only a fraction of that mass. According to the United Nations, around 1 million animal and plant species are currently threatened with extinction, many within decades, more than ever before in human history. The average abundance of native species in most major land-based habitats has fallen by at least 20%, mostly since 1900. We are losing wetlands, woods, forests, and jungles at an unprecedented rate. And climate change will only exacerbate and accelerate this biodiversity loss. In response, the UN created Sustainable Development Goal number 15, Life on Land, to protect life on Earth by restoring and promoting the sustainable use of terrestrial ecosystems, sustainably managing forests, combating desertification, halting and reversing land degradation, and halting biodiversity loss. The targets for this goal include ensuring the conservation, restoration, and sustainable use of terrestrial and inland freshwater ecosystems and their services, in particular forests, wetlands, mountains, and drylands. Promoting the implementation of sustainable management of all types of forests, halting deforestation, restoring degraded forests, and substantially increasing afforestation and reforestation globally. Combating desertification, restoring degraded land and soil, including land affected by desertification, drought, and floods, and striving to achieve a land degradation neutral world. Ensuring the conservation of mountain ecosystems, including their biodiversity, in order to enhance their capacity to provide benefits that are essential for sustainable development. Taking urgent and significant action to reduce the degradation of natural habitats, halt the loss of biodiversity, and protect and prevent the extinction of threatened species. Taking urgent action to end poaching and trafficking of protected species of flora and fauna, and addressing both demand and supply of illegal wildlife products. Introducing measures to prevent the introduction and significantly reduce the impact of invasive alien species on land and water ecosystems. Integrating ecosystem and biodiversity values into national and local planning, development processes, poverty reduction strategies, and accounts mobilizing and significantly increasing financial resources from all sources to conserve and sustainably use biodiversity and ecosystems. Guided by these targets, it's now up to all of us, governments, businesses, civil society, and the general public, to work together to protect all life on land. So, what can we do right now? Don't worry, we got this! And some of these things are already part of our sustainable living routines, like recycle. Eat a locally based diet that is sustainably sourced. Consume only what you need. Be respectful toward wildlife and only take part in ecotourism opportunities that are responsibly and ethically run in order to prevent wildlife disturbance. Be respectful of nature. Everyone loves a good selfie in a field of sunflowers, but if you have to crush them to get the perfect shot, just don't. 
Nature is not a lifeless soundstage for our social media adventures. And vote. Vote, vote, vote. Take part in your small town, local, state, national, anywhere you can make your voice heard elections. Vote like your life and the life of our planet depend on it. Because they do. Thank you for joining us, Swarmers. We will see you next time. And don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and did I mention vote?